Alright, Grace, we've been stuck in here for like 6,000 hours. Let's go do something. There's nothing to do here, Adrian. Even if there was, we would have done it already. Because like you said, we've been here for 6,000 hours. Come on, there has to be something we can do. I know we don't have any technology or internet or power, but we could go outside, like, we could wander around. It'll be fun. It definitely won't be fun, but it'll kill some time before Mom and Dad be here. I'll go get my shoes. Let's go to Grandma's shed. She probably has something in there. Eh, let's just go wander around the woods. Okay, fair enough. It's not like she's hiding something crazy in there. <laughs> Damn, what did Grandma do to entertain herself out here? There's nothing to do. She didn't do nature walks or anything. I guess she baked a lot? I don't know, I guess she had like a pretty nice kitchen, but it's not like she's near any stores or any people. She must have been really bored. Did Grandma have any neighbors? I don't ever remember seeing any of them when we were kids. I kind of do. There were only a few though, and she always complained about them. Oh yeah, there were a few, and I definitely remember her complaining about them. Hey, I see something on the ground up there. Let's go look. Yeah, I see it too. Now I'm scared. That is an underseat. Okay, not to freak us out even more, but I think there's a killer on the loose. We go to Grandma's shed. Maybe she has a gun or a shovel or something. I don't know. Something that might help protect us. Good idea. 